The MQ-9 Reaper entered service in 2007, and the Air Force's fleet of Reapers is now aging. The Air Force is concerned about the rising costs of maintaining and operating the Reaper fleet. The Air Force is now facing a more contested airspace, with adversaries like China and Russia developing increasingly sophisticated anti-air capability. The Reaper is not as stealthy or survivable as the Air Force would like in this new environment. The Air Force's new UAV program, MQ Next, is designed to address all of these concerns. The MQ Next UAV will be a more stealthy, survivable, and capable aircraft than the Reaper. The Air Force plans to begin fielding the MQ Next UAV in the mid-2030. In addition to the reasons listed above, the Air Force is interested in replacing the MQ-9 Reaper because it is a single-engine aircraft. This means that if the engine fails, the aircraft is lost. The Air Force is looking for a twin-engine UAV that would be more reliable and less likely to be lost in an engine failure.